Hello everyone, this is Just a Dad. Today I'm gonna to do a review on the Hamilton Beach Breakfast Sandwich Maker. So this is a really neat machine. You're gonna to have to plug it in. Now there is no on off switch, so anytime it's plugged in, it's going to be heating up. And then when you're done with it, you're gonna unplug it. And it's got two lights on it. It's called a preheat light and a power. So as soon as you plug it in, the power light's gonna come on. After about five minutes, when it warms up the temperature, the green light comes on. That means it's time to add everything. So let's take a look. It's got this little, uh, it, this is kind of like fits in this hinge area. So these surfaces here, they're kind of a non-stick surface, but we are going to spray them down before we use it with a little spray. Now here we have the sandwich maker, and this is a little slide. You're going to put the egg in here after the egg cooks, and you're going to slide this out to kind of make your sandwich. Now all of these parts here get really hot when you're making the sandwich. But the nice thing about it is this part is dishwasher safe. So you can take this out. These parts you'll just have to wipe off. So this part slides really nice into that hinge. And when you close it, it's kind of held in there. Here's what the bottom looks like. It's 120 volts, 60 hertz, 600 watts. Okay, so I just plugged it in. The red light is on. I'm going to start a timer, see how long it takes for the green light to come on. I'm going to be using some like egg, egg McMuffins. I've got an egg and I got a piece of cheese. You can also add meat but the meat should be somewhat pre-cooked. It doesn't necessarily have to be hot, ready to go, but it does need to be pre-cooked to make the sandwich. And while it's preheating, you want the lid, you want all the parts installed and the egg slide all the way slid in. So here's the egg slide, make sure that is all the way in. Okay, so that took only about three minutes and here kind of like a little snap. The green light is on. Okay, so we're gonna lift this lid and we're gonna lift this part here too. We're gonna put the top part of our Egg McMuffin down first. You would put your meat right here. I'm not gonna put any meat on my sandwich. You can put egg or a, a sausage or bacon. Put this down. Now you're gonna take your egg and you can crack your egg right in. This can be scrambled or like this, but it, it does say to poke the yolk with a toothpick. Now I can put my cheese right on top of that. And then it says, put the sandwich on and then close the lid. Don't try to smash it or anything, just leave it like that. Now you've got to time it from this point. So it says it takes about four to five minutes. So again, you're just gonna have to time it and then you're gonna lift it up. When we're, when we're at the four or five minutes, we're gonna slide that egg uh, slide out of the way so that we can complete our sandwich. Now you can sort of take a sneak peek, kind of lift this up. You can see how it's doing. Okay, so we're going on five minutes. We can get, we can lift this up, just get a little peek. Looks like it's doing pretty good. At the five minute mark, kind of hold this with a hot pad, but we're gonna slide this out. And then with another hot pad, you're gonna lift this part up to complete the sandwich. And it helps sometimes if you lift that up and then you may have to kind of push this down so that you can get it out. And then there's your sandwich. Okay, so then there's our sandwich. So I cut my sandwich in half, it's all of the egg is done. So unplug the unit, let it cool down. You can put that middle part in the dishwasher. You're just gonna have to wipe off this part. You can't get this um, part of the machine wet. So I hope this video helps. Thanks everybody for watching.